hi welcome back today we're playing starlight again i tried to start this video but my game crashed so i don't know what i recorded <laughs> and uh, we'll just oh hi bronia i forgot what i was saying thank just you for inviting me i'll be able to get away from the complexities of politics here being surrounded by these beautiful stars it's of course. such a joy i don't remember doing your companion quest though i'm guessing when I started recording before this, uh, or my first try, I had General Jin Yuan here. So I'm guessing they won't have a companion quest because their quest is the main quest, so they are already here. This seems like a recent development though, maybe with the last update? Although we've been through so much together, I actually know very little about the Astral Express. I'd like to start visiting more frequently if the opportunity arises. Oh my god, I love you so much, you are welcomed anytime. I actually don't know much about the Express either. You are always welcome here. Thank you. Hopefully I'll have more time to get to know the crew. I love you, please stay forever. I really enjoy vacation. staring out into the universe. What a vast, mesmerizing, romantic view. I hope that one day the children of Bellabog will have the same opportunity to witness the stars up close. Alright, who is in Bellabog right now? <laughs> As your vi vice? How do you say vice? Hmm. Please Second don't mind me. Feel free to go about your business. I think I'll stay here and enjoy the view a while longer. Okay. Okay, now that we said hi to Bronya, let's get back to business. We were doing this when my internet crashed my whole game. <laughs> let's see. Oh, bye. Do I have to read all of this again? Okay. Here's something you might like. Hashtag Romeo Phanto Phantoms, a young maiden accidentally entered an abandoned garden and found herself assailed by roaming ghosts in a den of peril. Hashtag thrills and chills, hashtag bone chilling. With ghosts hidden all over the abandoned garden, there is enough on-site danger to make someone choke. <laughs> live streaming now, live bro broadcast of paranormal activities. Two girls accidentally entered the garden and fell prey to vile ghosts. This is so full of keywords to be found by some target, specific target. The ghost hunting target, which is me. <laughs> I love ghost hunting. <laughs> I love the, the Watcher guys. <laughs> Shane Meday and Ryan Vergara are my favorite ghost hunters, are the best ghost hunters, the most serious ghost hunters, <laughs> if I may add. One turns as pale as a waxen moon, the other falls... Oh wow, nice choice of word, considering everything. Sorry. <laughs> the other falls to shock and is still in a coma. Freak. Viewing not advised for anyone below 200 years of age. In fact, <laughs> a AAA uh, experience. Supernatural occurrences keep happening. An inhabited go garden, sorry, concealed a mind-blowing secret. Amazing thumbnail. Love it for you. Get them, get that bag. <laughs> uh, for more deets about Ghost on the Shanzo, please like and follow Little Gui for more awesome content. Amazing. How do I watch it exactly? Yes, yes, so pray tell where, where can I see it? <laughs> Coffee is me. <laughs> ah, it sounds like you were interested, fam. Do we even know each other? <laughs> Canonically, I don't think so. Um. I haven't edited the stream recording yet, so I won't send the link. How about this? If you're really interested, then come find me. Very interested. Not interested. New scam, right? <laughs> very interested. Scam me, please. I'm very interested. Don't go anywhere. I'm coming to find you. All right, I read it up. I'm in dear need of someone like you who's burning with curiosity. I'm here at Oromalley. Uh, if uh, you see a red other travel traveler, um, oh traveler, sorry, I, I didn't read it right away because I was like, this is not Genshin Impact. <laughs> That's me, sorry. <laughs> okay, see, the um, I, I thought it would be just an event because it looked uh, like one of those that save, uh, but the the little icon is one of the um, Terblaze Continuous ones. So I wasn't exactly wrong, I think, maybe. Let's go. Ah, uh, yes. Okay, okay, okay. I didn't label it wrong <laughs> in my... Oh, I always forget to, tell, to say it, but um, if you want to keep up uh, with uh, 
when uh, and what I'm posting I usually post uh, updated uploading uh, schedules every week uh, and uh, uh, the first of the month an approximated one that will be subject to change so if you're interested in my community tab there's everything okay let's go oh my I did not unlock anything here so I have to go let's go <laughs> oh my oh boy okay wait Let's go with cannon. <laughs> okay, we're here. No, here. There's a chest. Found it. The little sparkle they Is do. That all? It's really useful to fi for finding them. <gasps> Hi, girly. I'm here for you. Uh, yo, it's you. Hi. You're interested in the supernatural, right? You're so cute, I didn't expect this voice. <laughs> Lucky for you, I just finished editing my stream. It's all the proof you need. Oh my. But before you watch it, I gotta ask you a question. Do you believe in ghosts? Not exactly. <laughs> Not exactly. I want to believe in ghosts. If only everything that is... Uh, ghost like wasn't quite easily explainable by something else i would believe it <laughs> mm, but it's fun to see ghosts somewhere even if it's not ghosts so i will not egg on anyone that sees something and says it's a ghost <laughs> even if i'm like maybe it's just a wind <laughs> because it's fun and also it's spooky, and I enjoy spooky. <laughs> um, I believe pizza already didn't happen, no, no clickbait. <laughs> My beliefs aside, your messages. Um, let's say I believe. I knew it! <laughs> Curious cats like us usually have a better sixth sense. Why? It's easier for us to perceive the unseen. Enough chit-chat. Look. This is the weird stuff that happened yesterday when I was streaming in Fixtral Garden. Show me, show me. What's up, guys? Hi. Little Gui here. Everything is so... the scariest, most haunted place in the Lofu. Fixtral Garden. Okay. Don't forget to like, follow, and share. Or Sing. I'm gonna check it out. They say there's been paranormal activity. You're such Why, you, you, you said you'd protect me. How do I stab something that doesn't have a body? <laughs> I saw nothing. Oh, I am seeing things. Okay, okay. This is super flames suddenly grew super big, and then they floated right out to us, and they were like, and Su Shang was like, and then she fell over. Mrs. Shang, can you get up? Aren't you getting cold? Oh my God. Okay. Me and my bestie got kicked out of the garden straight after. But did you see the key moment? <laughs> it was too funny. Okay. Um, 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 um okay. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> to chill. The goats were cheap special effects. Why is it in third person perspective at the end? Uh, the, oh, right. Good question. Who was holding it? The chicken? <laughs> the comments all look like uh, bot wrote them. I didn't look at the comments. Um. The second one. No, see, sí, the second one. Uh, it's called editing. Okay. I edited it. Okay. That way I can show what happened before and after. Can I? Anyway, the key moment was... Can I see the unedited version just for clarity, though? Because you could have added those orbs in editing. Most ghost orbs are probably are just dust. <laughs> so, so, why would I believe you? It wasn't the Realm Keeping Commission or the Cloud Knights that came to deal with it. It was the judges from the Ten Lords Commission. Oh, I was wondering when they would uh, introduce them. That's why I didn't think uh, this update was gonna be uh, pen pen Pentaconi? Be penta Pentaconi? I don't remember how to say it. Because that's so much on the Lufu that wasn't introduced yet, but also it could have been introduced later. <laughs> Judge from the Ten Lords Commission? That's crazy! What's the Ten Lord Commission? Um... <clears throat> Alaska! 
you've been on the CN Joe for this long and you've never heard of the Ten Lords Commission? I heard, but nobody explained it to me in a satisfying way, so please explain. They're the most mysterious organization on the CN Joe. Their investigators always pop up out of nowhere, then disappear without a trace. Why? If they show up, you know something serious is going down. In other words, something big must have happened in Fixtral Garden for them to show up. They went to buy Fixer Stroll Garden to catch ghosts? Maybe it was just a false alarm? Exactly! <laughs> now, do you believe that my content isn't clickbait? Not really, but for the sake of this quest, yes. <laughs> Actually, do you have some free time? Do you want to explore Fixtral Garden together? Sure. Just the two of us? Absolutely. I guarantee you we're gonna reveal the truth this time. I'd love to. The scariest thing of haunted places for me are the spiders. <laughs> I have a, a tinge bit of arachnophobia. If I, if I saw a spider in my room, I will not sleep in my room until someone catches it. <laughs> so, since it's a garden, if there aren't any uh, too many trees over my head, I should be fine. So no spider above my head, technically. Um, let's see the ghost together. Uh, you're going despite the risk? I'm a little scared. Let me think over it. Let's go! <laughs> let's see the ghost I together. I knew it! This is what people like us live for! Let's go! <laughs> she has the right vibe, I like her. <laughs> uh, I can't read all of those words. I'm very sorry. Sojourners ghastly revere? I'm sorry. Um, um, anyway, where am I going? Here! Oh, blah, blah, blah. Oh? I came up from Starskiff Haven. Oh, where? Wait! Oh, I, 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 wrong way! I don't Need believe to extract in clean to your I don't believe in ghosts. Time. Where are you? Look no further. Me neither, bro. Can't find him. Okay. Here, okay. Wow, we new map, new map, new map. <laughs> oh, so pretty. It's so dark in here. It feels like we're being watched. He's probably a spider. <laughs> spider watching me is scarier than ghosts watching me, honestly. <laughs> um. Did anyone ever tell you the scary stories about Fixtral Garden? Nobody told me shit. Uh, don't think so? Would you make it quick? <laughs> no, tell me, don't think so. You're so pretty. Then allow me. As a streamer, I've done my fair share of research. Let me <laughs> find my script. My, you're so organized. <clears throat> oh, cute! Wandering fox spirits and ghostly tales. Fixtral Garden was originally a garden delve constructed by a foxy and craftmaster. Who's your source? It was a place for their kin to rest, write poems, and feast, etc. etc. Okay. Okay, but what's your source? It, it said the elite pilots of the Foxians were almost wiped out in the denizens of Abundance War 30 years ago. People went to the Foxum tomb in Fixtral Garden to grieve for the departed. Because of this, Fixtral Garden rarely saw visitors and was bereft of joy. Over time, Fixtral Garden became full of flickering ghostly flames and mm. weeping lamentations echoed through the air. There are a lot of the rumor that the garden was haunted spread like wildfire among Sienjo Lofu residents. Okay, I saw a lot of sparkles. Are you sure they are not confusing them for uh, Foki Fatui or whatever the name is in English? Um, sounds like the hauntings in uh, Fixer, Fixtr Fixtrol. I'm gonna say Fixtrol Garden <laughs> could uh, could be true after all. And uh, who wrote that for you? I quite, I, I quite sorry. <laughs> there, that's what I want to know. What's your source? Aw, man, is it that obvious? <laughs> I paid Mr. Cian to write it up for me. Bro. Sounded a little too professional, huh? <laughs> I know it's easy to cast doubt, but the Ten Lords Commission actually showed up this time. Okay, but your setup is not helping me believe you. Speaking of which, we have to avoid running into the judges. 
If we get kicked out, it'll all be for nothing. So you're making me do illegal stuff. Okay. Anyway, that's the background. <laughs> Let's keep moving and watch your step. Sure. Okay. Where are we going? <gasps> Angkor. Angkor, Angkor. Um, uh, let me see the map. <gasps> We're going there. Okay, I see. Let me... I'll go this way first because it's, uh, it looks like a close... Uh, like, like, um, no, no, a dead end, sorry. That's how you say. Who is this? Wait, wait, wait. Okay. Stop. I'm stopping. There are ten Lord's Commission spirit fairs on patrol. Let's go the other way. It looks we'll so head to the Foxum tomb first. Then cut through the Locky Fox forest. Okay. They look so pretty, though. Oh, you turned me around. Okay. Oh, Baba. So, what's up here? Before I go the right way? Nothing I can touch. Got it. I love this place. It also seems like a bigger map than the last two I got. From ending uh, main quest Looks good. and uh, the last uh, Terrorblade Continuance for Bellobog. I hope you don't hear my stomach growling. <laughs> I forgot to eat. <laughs> um. Whoa. This place feels pure evil. Is that? Are those? Uh... Time to get some footage. <laughs> I need a laugh. <laughs> um. What's. We. Um. <gasps> new enemies. 71? Oh, wow. That's high. Let me just. Let's wait and see. Will of preservation. Show your courage. Um. Uh, I have just one of their, their weaknesses. I'll be fine though, right? My only good DPSs are Dunhang in Babitor Lune and Sampo <laughs> because he is E5 okay. and I thought uh, maybe I should do something with him and turns out I did something with him. <laughs> He's kind of good. <laughs> well, I didn't doubt it. <laughs> but still. Eternal sleep is not dead return. He's a four star, but uh, I think he's a unavoidable valuable unit. Me your strength. I obviously have uh, none of their weaknesses. To guard and defend. Well, I have fire. Heaven search. But who need weaknesses when you have done hung? Not me. Ouchie. See, enemy. I actually don't need their weaknesses. <laughs> um, maybe we should go. Okay. Oh boy. Let's just Eternal sleep go like this right there. off the bat, so they don't come back. We've entered the storm. To guard and defend. Crush, Crush them. them. Okay, I'm a mom. -am. Lance ablaze. Okay, this should at least uh, keep a few of them still. I don't think it's one of his things uh, to give them uh, burn, but his light cone should be the one. And I love it for me, honestly. <laughs> There's always a weakness. Get back. We've entered the storm. To guard and defend, crush them. And it's really comfy to just be able to this burn the shit out of them. <laughs> Lend me your strength. Sent a storm. Heaven search. Break. Amazing. <laughs> Thank you, Danhang. <laughs> Danhang is the, is my only weakness for sure. Okay. Ample supplies. <laughs> I forgot she says this when she opens stuff. <laughs> it's my favorite. <gasps> okay. Uh, this way I should go. What? Oh wow. What? Well, it's the only way. <laughs> um. Let me crush everything I see. A chest! I won. What are these thingies? I think I'll get back to them. Because having such a big decoration makes no sense. Oh? 
still, 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 no, I don't know how to read it. The short period between birth and death in the inscription vividly shows the misfortune of the own, of one's life. Oh, oh, wow, this is a child. Okay. Um. Um. um that was sad. <laughs> I'm sorry. Ah, uh, ba ba ba. I I love ba ba. I I chill. Who's hey? Who's here? It looks like there's someone up ahead. Oh ba ba ba. Let's sorry. go around. Oh yes. Sorry. Give me a second. Ah, uh, same thing. Oh my goodness. Very sorry. Are we sure you? We can go around. Where around where? My my girly. No, I have to go. I have to go toward. <coughs> I think this is the only way. Or maybe I can. She's on me! Sorry! <laughs> I have to... I, this is not going around. <laughs> you chose the wrong enemy. Oh god, they are so hot! <laughs> um, um, uh, um, I will behave. Eternal sleep. Ali! Whoa, I didn't know you were so strong, bro. <laughs> but these are Lawfu officials. If we're interrogated, we need to get our story straight. Oh. So, what's our story? We were possessed. Uh, but a ghost did this. Look at this, so cute. I... I can't read this one, but there's incense burning. That's very nice. I don't have to go that way, right? Where am I? Uh, of course I have to go that way, okay. <laughs> Let's go. Should I first explore this way? God, I hope you really don't need my, my you don't hear my my, my stomach growling because <laughs> it's doing it frequently. Why don't I eat? Sometimes. Oh, I, I probably didn't need to go that way. Uh, from the map, it looked it looked like it. I think the map was right. Let me see this enemy though. Oh my! The, everyone is so pretty. Wait. Um, no! Everything, I could have gone either way, because it was a circle. Amazing. Okay. Let's piss off uh, this person. <laughs> Sorry, that wasn't even her weaknesses. I could have also avoided that while... <laughs> I see you off. There we are. Where am I? Okay, I know where I am. Sorry. <laughs> I lied. Uh... Can I maybe avoid you? If I take it real. Se la prendo alla larga. Ecco. Oh! Probably because of the anchors. I don't know how to say alla larga in English. <laughs> oh, whoop, whoop. Halt! Halt indeed. Whoa, I was halted. What's up, guys? Hear me out. I'm uh... State your name and your business. Arrest them immediately. Coffee! Ghosts! <laughs> my name and my business. <laughs> oh. This is not Individuals in a restricted area are detained first and interrogated later. No exceptions. Valid. Restricted area? Since when were you in charge of Fixtral Garden? Well, it doesn't matter since when. They, they are in charge, apparently. Anyway. What is it? No, is it that we're waiting for? Sorry. Eternal sleep. <laughs> There we go. Oops. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. whoa but you can step on me anytime. <laughs> Jesus. Oh my god. I don't know what is happening. I'm not disliking it. <laughs> god. Receive divinity. Thank nice you. Teamwork. My love. Okay. Grace. I'll see you all. <laughs> Grace. Um, we have the thingy on, so we're fine. Lend me your strength. Thanks. Lend it. Sent a storm. At ease, Wraith Warden. These two are not your enemies. You look so tired. Same. And I love it. <laughs> you, you are lovely. Um, um, um. Also, there is the pretty girl from um, Danhang POV. Um, I remember I didn't do the last part of Danhang POV, maybe? In part two of this one, because it's gonna be in two parts, because I don't have time, again, uh, today. <laughs> um, I might... Um, show it at the end so if you don't care about seeing it it's probably like 10 minutes like the others but you can skip it anyway 
But at least... Understood, Your Honor. So, baby. Special invo- Wee! Hi! Baby! Look how pale she is. Mom. And it seems like her eyes aren't even focusing. <gasps> is she a ghost? Girl. <laughs> Girl, if she were a ghost, why would the uh, other official take order from her? Also, she's hot. Stop being rude. <laughs> as a member of the Ten Lords Commission, you may as well consider me a member of the dead. Oh. I am a judge, alias Hanya, responsible for the four duties of detention, incarceration, interrogation, and punishment. Therefore, I know a thing or two about you. I am not saying anything. You can't prove I've go I was gonna say anything. I'm gonna proceed ahead. Gwenaifan, an outworlder unemployed. You entered Fixtral Garden with Sushan, I'm a cloud knight, the day before yesterday. I thought you were a pro streamer. Uh, unemployed? <laughs> I'm a street performer and oh. a streamer who reports on current events. A Do you pay streamer. taxes? It's a legit operation. <laughs> okay, okay. If you pay taxes, you have a job. That's the rules. <laughs> As for this one here... I'm coffee, nice to meet you. Uh, your honor, it was all <laughs> kind of <over> ideas. <laughs> okay. Um, you must have heard of the Galactic Baseballer. <laughs> because I use a baseball bat. <laughs> ah, I'm coffee, nice to meet you. Yes, oh baby. A passenger on the Astral Express and a guest of the Seat of Divine Foresight. You assisted the Cloud Knights in resolving the Ambrosial Arbor Calamity, and are a friend of the Alliance. I am not... I am being respectful. Shut up. Uh, hello. I'm a judge of the Ten Lords Commission. You're so baby. My name is Hua Hua. Oh, that's how you say your name. Hua Hua? Also, also... The little ears, uh, it's uh, like the, um, she's also kind of also green. It's like the little ear on Sucrose. They're so cute. As a judge of the Ten Lords Commission, you should speak with more confidence, Hua Hua. Oh, okay. She's also so tired. I kind of want to pull for her, but I already have a reliable healer, and I could put her on a second squad to do the... The memory of chaos. But tell me, should be responsible. Gwenaifan, why did you return here? Uh, <laughs> no reason. I haven't posted anything for ages, so I wanted to film some ghosts for my videos. Are we filming? <laughs> or is this a pathetic excuse for showing me around? <laughs> and showing me around is how is it better than just telling me she was showing stuff to me? We have already told you there are no ghosts on the Xianzhou. It is a ridiculous superstition. As a resident of the Xianzhou, you should refrain from believing or spreading rumors. But I saw them! They had ghostly flames coming out of their body, and they were cackling! A and Sushang saw them too! Miss Gwenaifen, it's hard to explain, but those things aren't ghosts. Oh, please don't bring legends from your homeworld onto the Xianzhou. Okay, what are they? The roaming entities you saw are extremely dangerous energy parasites. Oh. We call them Heliobi. Heliobi? I... Really? I don't believe it. Heliobi? What's that? <gasps> Bro, that's oh, disrespectful. I get it. Heliobi is just another word for ghost on the Xianzhou, right? That's gotta be it. Girl, you don't know everything. Be respectful. If this isn't your culture, you should trust them on the word and do your research. Because your previous research sucked. <sighs> Maybe space. we should let Mr. Tail out for a bit. Oh? Uh, Mr. Tail. Mr. Tail? Is there a ghost in your tail? Are these... Is your tail being uh, contained? <laughs> and what does that entail? <laughs> I heard you, I heard you. Unbelievable. So cute. What have I, her pet? 
Mr. Tail? I'm a Heliobus. We're not ghosts. Got it? Now scram! <laughs> you look funny. <laughs> oh, but, but, I know this was supposed to be tra threatening, but I don't feel very threatened. <laughs> oh, girl, don't scream. <laughs> Please! They told you already it's not a ghost. <sighs> what a strange girl. <laughs> Here to film ghosts, yet terrified when she lays eyes on one. Oh, so you're saying it is a ghost? Deep breaths, little Grey. Deep breaths. <clears throat> Can I have a small chat with this Mr. Tail? Only if supervised, I'm guessing. I said scram! <laughs> I have no time to talk nonsense with you! What a rude ghost? Let's go, he doesn't want to talk to us. Let's Finally! Go. Someone with common sense! You're welcome. <laughs> she was... Uh, she bothered the people enough, I think. <laughs> no no we, way! Let's say, we bothered this you enough. This is a once-in-a-lifetime opportunity to get something for my vids! You're very invasive, girly. Your Honor, if I may ask, what exactly is this fire thing? How can we prevent it from hurting people? And why is a judge carrying one around with her? I believe we're done here. <laughs> we have Thank important you. matters to attend to. Hua Hua, please see them off. Yep, let's go. End of the quest. <laughs> yes, ma'am. Sister, don't be angry. Most of your time is spent in the field. You're not accustomed to dealing with others. Oh, leave this to me. What am If I explain the reasoning, they will leave. Um... As things stand, the situation in Fixtral Garden is sure to keep drawing attention. If we forcibly dismiss these two today, their curiosity will remain. Who knows what might happen if they decide to come back. They might not be lucky enough to run into us next time. As I said, sister... Is this actually dangerous? I will handle this. I assume the two of you heard about the damage done to the Artisanship Commission's creation furnace? Yes. The Heliobi sealed within escaped, and have been haunting this place. The Ten Lords Commission has orders to capture them. I am strongly they see you advising the you to leave, for your own safety. Okay, can I help in some way, yeah, besides from leaving? <laughs> if you have any questions, raise them now. Mm. I will do my best to satisfy your curiosity. Thanks, but I hope you will keep any information you hear in strict confidence, and then leave Fixtral Garden, never to return. I wouldn't trust both of us <laughs> with keeping the secret. That's that's very reasonable, Your Honor. Thank you. I promise we'll leave after asking our questions. Okay. As a clerk at the Hall of Karma. My knowledge on these matters is somewhat limited, but I will try my best to satisfy your curiosity. Please proceed. Are these shorts or are these transparent like these ones? Is this all you have to cover? That's very dangerous, ma'am. But if you're comfortable, that's fine. You are very pretty, it suits you, and that's all it matters. <laughs> what exactly are Iliobi? Um, are Iliobi dangerous. In your bio or in your B, if it's plural? I don't have any other questions. I can ask all of them, I think. According to the Divination Commission's classification, they are energy parasites from the cosmos itself. They are starfire essence that materialize in the form of strange fire. If they are parasitic... Uh, parasitic? That's a word? If they are parasite, is that why you are so tired? <laughs> is uh, he sucking on your energy and the result is you being tired. So what, do you have one too or you're just tired like me? <laughs> Metaphorically speaking, they are like moths to a flame. But that flame is the thoughts of sentient beings. Are uh, Ilio, Iliobi or Iliobi dangerous? Yes. Oh. They attach themselves to sentient beings. Feeding off their host's experiences and emotions. Oh my. A heliobus will slowly take root in its host's nervous system, 
using their deepest desires and weaknesses to create wild delusions. Es they manipulate their host like a chess piece. The host has no choice but to obey the Helio bus, so we refer to it as possession. This is very interesting. It could, could be used for a major plot point instead of just a side. Um, Trailblaze continues continuous mission. I wonder if they will recycle it, sorry, <laughs> as a concept, because it's very, very fun. By that point, the host is no longer who they once were, but a Heliobus both similar to and completely different from their past self. Oh, that's so sad. The host's body will soon be exhausted by the Heliobus, like burnt firewood. So, how are you fine? So, Tail is dangerous too? Dangerous? Oh, you don't know the half of it. The other Heliobi are nothing compared to me. Um, Tail was subdued and sealed in my tail by Madame Hanya. Oh? He won't harm others. Why your tail? Regrettably, Heliobi are not flesh and blood, and so they are difficult to destroy. Okay. Before the restoration of the Creation Furnace, the Ten Lords Commission plans to set up an evil binding matrix in this abandoned garden to imprison mm. these abominations. Got it. You don't have any more question. Any As other you question? can see, the evil binding matrix has not yet been completed. Oh, that's what these are. All the escaped Heliobi have been recovered. This area is still very dangerous. I will ask Judge Huohua to escort you out of the garden. Makes sense. Thank you for your patience. Not all the escaped Heliobi have been recovered. So that means the other supernatural stuff that's been happening on the Law Fu might be related? Your Honor, I have loads of info sources. Maybe I can help you. Are they re reliable sources? Unnecessary. Those <laughs> not involved should leave now. Valid. Go. Let's go. Um, excuse me. Oh, we should go. Super valid. Oh, oh, ah. Oh, wow, my frame rate. Okay, now it's normal. <laughs> Over there is my objective, so I'm gonna talk to Anya first. Hmm. So garden pretty. is full of abnormalities. Even the Ten Lords Commission cannot guarantee your safety. I suggest you leave immediately. On it. Can I zoom on you? Let me, let me just... Sorry. <gasps> wow. Goodness. So pretty. I'm still very worried about your shorts. But at least your butt is co... Is your butt covered? Yes, it is. Okay. <laughs> okay, I was very worried for nothing. Uh, oh, I want to break this one. <laughs> no. Uh, but, but that way is the... Hi, um, Shui I don't know how to read you. I'm sorry. I did look it up. This but I place forgot. is dangerous. You should leave at once. Yes, ma'am. My goodness, the hip window, the back window, the everything window. <laughs> My goodness, everyone is so pretty. Let me zoom on you too. I wish there wasn't a text box box on you. God, I love her so much. Uh, I hope she comes out soon. I know Anya is in the next couple of banners. And I wanted to pull for Silver Wolf anyway. I thought I would want uh, a Drenty, but I kind of don't. <laughs> don't know why. Ghost? He's a pretty boy. I should want possession? him. That was a big info dump. My brain is still loading. Maybe once I know his character better, I, I will want him. But for now, I think I'll pull Silver Wolf because she's convenient. <laughs> oh, it all sounds more like an urban myth than a ghost story. Energy Parasite sounds more cool than scary, don't you think? No. <laughs> um, a parasite is scary either way. <laughs> um... um Myths are born of, out of ignorance. Ghost can't exist without mystery. Second mm, one is less I mean. I never thought about it like that. <laughs> nice take. It's the, the less mean I can be. 
My audience likes getting to the bottom of mysteries, secrets, and conspiracies. Ooh. We streamers have to cater to that, you know? Uh, I've got like loads more questions, but my curiosity is satisfied for now. We better leave before the judges decide to arrest us. Mm. I'm gonna see if I can get a video of Mr. Tail on the way back. I've already got the title. Demonic fire suddenly appears in Fixtral Garden. Innocent Foxy and girl possessed. What do you think? That I... gets so many views. I, yes, but I don't like it. <laughs> um. Can you give me a hand? Nah. -uh. What are we gonna do with you? Nope. <laughs> You'll be ended a few centuries of jail time if you irritate the judge. I think reasoning will come through her best. Mm, true. But I'd probably only do a few decades. <laughs> Still uh, not worth it, babes. Let's go. Unless jail time is what you want. Because, like, sometimes free food and a place to stay <laughs> doesn't sound bad, but uh, I don't think the. What? I don't think the conditions are the best in a jail. In a prison, sorry. Excuse me. So you might not Can want we it. go now? Yep. Is they coming too? You look nervous. I I'm just a bit scared about the heliobite reports, but I'll carry out my duties and escort you out of the garden. I wanna squeeze you. Should be able to do that at least. I wanna pull for you, fuck. <laughs> You're adorable. I I have a few good healers. I don't need another one, but I kind of want that. <laughs> and also Silver Wolf. <laughs> If you can't, then you'd better give up the day job and start peddling desserts. Mm -hmm. If it weren't for you, I would have opened a dessert stall ages ago. Oh. Did he force you into this career? Shall we go? My baby. Um, um yes, please lead the way. Let's go. I hope I did everything. <gasps> Let's Walking. go this way. It's quicker. Okay. M Miss Puahua, can we have Mr. Tail come out for a photo? No! Shut up! Miss Queen Ifen, I'm on official duty right now. Tell him. It's so quiet. Be nice. It's getting scarier and scarier. <gasps> Sorry. Please stay close to me. I'm very close. Did you hear that? What? What was that sound? Stop! <laughs> things, things do sounds. <laughs> Stop it! Oh my god, I'm all entangled. Sorry, it's not a ghost, probably. What's happening? She's freaking out over nothing. Don't, don't be scared. <laughs> oh, is it the same kind of thing as Mr. Tail? Oh, we're all good. Let's keep going. Tail, is it another Heliobus? It's nothing, you scary cat. I didn't see a single thing. And then what the freak did you scream about Wait a minute. them? Where did Miss Queenifen go? Uh, oh. Miss Queenifen! She didn't book it, did she? <sighs> oh, I'm sorry, babes. Did we lose her? We're being such an handful. Um, okay, I'm going to look for her. Oh, no. We have to find Miss Queen Ifen. I got you, babe. You should consider your own safety first. Yeah, let's stay close. Is it me, or is this place starting to feel weirder and weirder? Oh, I'm scared. Can you stay close to me? I don't oh. want to lose you too. Of course. Oh my God. Hey, stay close. I don't know how to carry you with me, but I would. Like Princess Carrie, you are very cute, and also probably very light. Wait, this way. I think. Yes. Why is my frame rate like this? Sorry. <laughs> this way? What is this way? The wrong way. That's what is. <laughs> Hi. Hello. Gourly. Oh. Queen Ifen, where are you? Queen Ifen, I've been seeing it close. wrong. What? We lost her. <laughs> but. Ho Oh, oh no, where did she go? I love his voice acting. I am always happy when he talks. Oh, fuck. We're screwed. 
We're about to get ghosts. Ghosted. <laughs> but not in the, this, in the this, messaging kind um, of way. Mirror? That looks no, a little creepy. No, stay away from mirrors. Don't you freaking know? The, the culture behind window uh, be, behind the uh, mirrors they they they, they are believed uh, to be portals uh, and stuff uh, uh, that's a cute I... face though oh i'm not adorable oh no oh no see <laughs> where well, am i i don't know man <laughs> is this Fixtural garden? But it looks different somehow. Maybe it's upside down or. Uh... I should keep moving. Okay. Oh god, I don't have a map. So. So. I'm scared. I don't play horror games. I love watching the gameplays. But, uh, okay, this is... I'm going right. Yes, I, it's probably a maze. Technically, in mazes, if you always go right, from the start, you should find a way out. I was wrong. Probably. <laughs> right. I just go right. What is going on? I looped back again? What is this? Can I read anything? I need no. to look closely around this place again. Maybe closer? I can break out of the cycle. Sorry, I got close again. Uh, okay. We are going right, babes. That's the maze rule. Uh, I was saying, I don't play horror games. Maybe these sparkles indicate something. Well, should I go to the sparkles? But the right. I go to the sparkles. Oh, I can't go to the sparkles. Oh, it seems like the paths here are being twisted by some sort of illusion. Oh, what's this? I need to look closely around this place again. Maybe I can break out of the cycle. Okay, so it's the left. Are these? Uh, Sorry, I'll get close for a second. Paper dolls. They look like bunnies. Maybe they are from uh, where? Where? Or how do you say your name? Um, okay. I was saying I don't play horror games. I love watching gameplays, though. They are my favorite thing to fall asleep. <laughs> I think it's normal. <laughs> don't judge me. <laughs> it's like uh, listening to true crime. <laughs> I had a true crime phase. But I was getting paranoid, so I stopped. Where? Uh... Oh, sparkle. There are no dolls here. Dolls, sorry. Dolls, dolls. Hola. With the open up. Dolls. Should I go straight? Um, I could be convinced to play an horror game. Or is this the wrong way again? Yes, I don't see the dolls anymore. Anyway, sorry, I could be convinced to play another game, maybe uh, next Halloween. Wasn't I just here a moment ago? Fuck. Where are they? I need to look closely around this place again. Maybe mm. I can break out of the cycle. Okay, let's try again. <laughs> <laughs> oh. You've noticed it, no? All roads are but puzzles in this place. I think I got it. Amazing. Come, I'm a genius. one. <gasps> Do you desire to leave? Yes. Come and find me. Okay. Hmm. You have a strange sense on you. You must be. Who? Who am I? I have heard the whispers of the leaves that fall in Fixtral Garden. The flames weep and profess to me that a powerful mortal approaches. Am I powerful? <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> They carry the scent of a great battle. Oh. With none other than Fentilia. So. You. You are the one who drove Fentilia away. I am one of the ones. <laughs> what power. Your presence alone is delicious enough to make one tremble. Let me Don't. taste you, please. Don't. One bite. 
Just one bite. Sì, è lui, per me. The little drop. Same. Same dude. Ok, ok. Let's get These this thing out of my way. Of course not. I have a bot. Here are pawns dancing to my web. Thank you for giving me a bot. Because I had a lance and uh, these are not a weak to fire. Just a scratch. Just a scratch indeed. I hope this is not my build with the bat. Smash them. Smash them to pieces. Now I don't want to. What a peppery fighting spirit. Such an addictive flavor. Now you don't want to. What? <laughs> Don't tell me what to do. <laughs> Let me see. The one who defeated Ventilia. I wonder what they taste like. Don't to fucking there. That's my child. Okay. Oh my god. <laughs> you fought well. You're fighting for your survival after all. Up, up, up. Uh, okay, I won't question anything. I'll take that as my invitation to inhabit you for a while. No, thank you. Who are you and what do you want? I said no, get out. Yeah, no means no. Fine, just stay put and don't cause trouble. I said no. Resisting, are we? Impressive willpower. How painful. How delectable. Ew. You're different from anyone else I've ever possessed. But what is this at your core? A sun? <laughs> it burns! Good! Worry not. I have no interest in making you my home. Okay. I'll be gone before you know it. Okay. <laughs> Let's get along while it lasts. Shall we? See, si, okay. If you talk to me like that from the start and ask for my collaboration and consent, I might have helped you. <laughs> Why do you have to force yourself on me? <laughs> you can call me Cirrus. I only want to leave this place. I have no desire to harm you. Okay, see? Communication! <laughs> I don't know if I believe you, but I, yeah, I'm prone to believe in you. Allow me to explain what's happening. Okay. The Sanjo natives call it a ghost lock. You're walking in a circle, and no amount of walking will get you out of it. So, I'm going to help you break free of the circle that Furinox created. And you're going to help me evade the judges of the Ten Lords Commission. <laughs> it's a win-win. How does that sound? Um, um, uh, it sounds complicated, but I'll collaborate for now. What did you just say? Who's Furinox? You must have figured out that I'm not the master of this place. It was created by another Heliobus named Furinox. Furinox. Not for us. <laughs> Unfortunately, I'm the only one who can help you escape from here. Okay. I've already found clues that can get me out of here. <laughs> you mean the talismans left behind by little lost fox judge? Oh, it was a... Uh... Those won't help you. Oh. <laughs> now that I'm possessing you, I can make you see things that you couldn't see before. Oh my, elemental sight. <laughs> Oh, fine. This is just a strategic, strategic partnership. I refuse to work with you. I could refuse. What happens if I refuse? Do I get stuck? You sounded pretty reasonable right now. <laughs> Good. I collaborate. I'm glad we understand each other. As a courtesy, I shall leave you intact for the time being. As soon as I get what I want, I'll be gone. Okay. Now... Go and look at those the talismans was again. Scary. The paper dolls. You'll know where to go. Hey, okay. I guess I know. <laughs> go. Find all those clues your judge friend left behind. Find the talismans. Okay. You can trust me. I want to leave this place too. We are useful to each other. I don't like you. In any case, it doesn't matter if you don't trust me. I don't. It's not like you can be rid of me. Rude. <laughs> Oh, cute. Okay. So, straight. So I couldn't hey, see those ones. Use your eyes. I made the talismans float. Pay attention. <laughs> the 
There are so many paper dolls over there. Surely your judge friend left some clues for you. Won't you take a look? I will. Don't trust you at all. Okay. Oh god, I have to read. Is it long? It is! Freak! Okay, this is part two. Where is part one? Did I miss something? Oh, freak. Okay. It is said that in his manner that day, General Tang Xiao was in deep thought, devising strategies and conducting simulation to break the encirclement of the Borisin's forces. Suddenly, a strange wind blew through the hall, causing the curtains to flutter. General Tang Xiao stood up with his hand behind his back and spoke to the empty room. It is impolite to be an uninvited guest. And even more to hide in the shadow. Show yourself quickly. Laughter echoed through the empty hall and suddenly a formless green flame appeared, resembling a ghostly eye. Oh, it's you! Um, fixating its eerie gaze on the general. I heard that each of the Rainbow Arbiter Generals possess exceptional abilities uh, and seeing you today confirms those, those rumors. Um, sorry again for my yeses. <laughs> I entered this halls without prior notice and for that I apologize. However, my purpose here is to assist you in breaking the encirclement. The Borisian's forces are closing in with the intention of completing, completely annihilating the Luofu. Your troops are few and resisting the enemy is as difficult as reaching the heavens. Although the green flame had no mouth, it seemed to converse like a person. It hovered through the air, illuminating the dark corners of the hall. The guards in the hall stood expression expressionlessly, sorry, as if trapped in a dream. Facing life and death in a battle, mortals tremble in fear. But if you allow us, the Iliobai or Iliobi, to possess you, you have no fear of the blade of the or the enemy. Defeating them will be as easy as turning your hand. Your help freely offered must come with an exchange. I heard that uh, the Rainbow Ones exchanged their mortal body for aid from the Blint Emperor. I assume uh, you have similar intention. I, Ig Ignamar? Nice name. Seek nothing more than your body and emotion, General of the Rainbow. The Jade Flame burned brighter, growing to a side a hundredfold bigger than before. I have been dormant for a millennium, and there is no better corporeal offering for us than this. The General remained unfazed, signaling Ignamar to continue. At midnight tonight, I shall await your answer in Big Stroll. I still can't read it, Garden. <laughs> At the garden entrance, there will be several porcelain vases, some cerulean and some vermilion. If you refuse my offer, leave the cerulean vase pristine and unarmed. Okay, refuse, leave the cerulean pristine. At the same time, with the vermilion vases, you should break them all to indicate you accept my offer and wish for bloody battle. Okay, since they are underlined, let me just take a screenshot, <laughs> because I don't trust my memory. <laughs> that is how we will be able to decipher your reply, General. After, after tonight, if you wish to meet me again, knock with the left door knocker three times back, followed by the right knocker three times. No more, no less. How does the General remember all of this since they are not write da written down? Okay. A mere malevolent spirit dares to steal one's soul and mimic human behavior. Away, and I will respond in time. Okay. Do you understand? No. This story of the supernatural is in the illusory maze for a reason. It contains the clue to help us get out of here. Come back and read it again if you need to. I took a screenshot. <laughs> um, R? Okay, I understood now. Investigate? The gloomy doors are silent. You follow the instruction in the book and knock on the door. Three times on the left, three times on the right. The door will not open without the proper courtesies. 
Return from where you came, visitors. Everything returns to normal. The vases. Where are the vases? Ah, here. Okay, so Cerulean unharmed with the break them all. If you accept, should I accept? Well, the little flames are on the vermilion vases, so I'll do as I'm told. I don't feel great about this, though. Can I go now? The courtesies have been performed. Enter, oh honored guests. Thank you, I don't feel great about this. <laughs> the door cracks open a silver. Through the cracks you notice uh, that there is no one behind the door, as if the voice from before have never existed. It seems like we're ready. Now we just have to get out. Okay. Good, because I have like 10 more minutes. And then I have to go. It's on... Oh! There you are. Yep. <laughs> See? I told you I'd help you. Mm. The way out is straight ahead. Just keep going. I'm scared. Don't wanna let you out. Oh! Stop! My friends! Do you remember our deal? You need to help me evade capture. Judge a judge up ahead. What? Are you scared? I'm getting her out of here too. I keep my promise. I did not make a deal with you. I'm getting it out of here. Well, is this what humans call sympathy? How acerbic. <laughs> <laughs> That's a nice noise, though. Forget about the judge. Good job, voice Just actor. get us both Actors, out of here. I think. Hi, friend. Hi. You're so small. <gasps> oh, it's you. I finally found another living soul! Hi. I'm so happy! Oh. I thought I was gonna be stuck here forever. I'm so happy to see you. Um, have you seen Miss Gwen, I don't know I if she's still here. haven't found her. Is she gonna be okay? She's probably not here. Let's go find her. She's probably trapped somewhere around here. Forget about her. I got possessed by a wowie. Um, okay. Mm, let's go Give find it up. her. Gwenaifan was probably eaten by the Helio by already. Oh my! So no matter what, she, they are talking for me. Huh? How can that be? If that could happen to someone as lively as Miss Gwenaifan, that means I'm in even more danger. <laughs> Did I just say that? Did Gwenaifan really get eaten by uh, by Helio by? Um. <laughs> Did you know? That the larynx is the easiest muscle to control in the human body? Oh, you can find the way out, right? Please yeah. take me with you. Yes, I would love to. I don't know if I can. Not this again. You're a judge of the Ten Lords Commission. Why are you always begging others for help? You know I'm not cut out to be a judge. Huh? I thought maybe if I worked long enough in the Ten Lords Commission, I'd get braver. But now... I know it's impossible. Oh, baby. <laughs> Useless brat. Why was I sealed in with someone like you? You talk tough all day long, then let both of us get stuck in a trap. Who's the useless brat now? <laughs> Tell him! <gasps> Calm down, I'll get out of here. I'll get you out of here. I can't find a way out either. It's all up to you. Help, I got possessed by a alien bus. <laughs> um... Uh... I can't say any of this anyway. There's no point in following me. I'm leaving, and you're not coming with me. Goodbye. Ah, wow. No! Please don't leave! Wait, please! Um, uh, his voice is kind of nice, though. I didn't say that! Serious, you beast! <laughs> beast? From a taxonomic perspective, I believe you're closer to that definition. I believe it, too. <laughs> the Ten Lords Commission needs to overhaul oh. their hiring criteria. How did someone as useless as you ever become Don't be a judge? Rude to her. <laughs> oh. oh no, I want to hug her. Hey, cut it out! I'm the only one around here who gets to tell this kid off. Me and those other judges. Got that? So cute. Okay, I see. Uh, yes, I got Wait. it. Hold on. 
I smell something familiar. Sirius, am I, am I it's it? you. Still a fan of your pathetic ventriloquist act, I see. I am saved. Thank you, babes. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this is funny. This is just too funny. I thought you'd already escaped the furnace's destiny of torture. Why is this hot? <laughs> Who would have thought that a piece of Ignamar the Great, the fragment with the most fight in it, would become a guard dog sealed inside a Kwai baby? Oh, you were Ignamar the Great. Oh, forgive me. Did I say guard dog? No, 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 that won't do. You're just a guard dog's tail, right? Just a tail, a tail, a tail. <laughs> it's so funny, though. I'm sorry. But if all you can't, coward, I'm gonna swallow you whole the second you leave that boy's body. Yeah, I hope they <laughs> leave. <laughs> Terrifying. <laughs> the joke's on you. You couldn't leave that judge's body if you tried. You can't eat her, let alone escape from her. <laughs> Mr. Tail, you're pathetic. <laughs> Darn it! Uh, think of something, you wimp. <laughs> oh, Mr. Trailblazer, take this talisman and stick it to your body. It'll temporarily suppress the Heliobus's influence. <laughs> I can still move, right? <laughs> oh. Hey, boy, say something nice to Wawa. Her oh. crying is like a mosquito in my ear. I can't say anything, I'm sorry. I wish I could. Oh my. Cirrus talks nothing but nonsense. But even so, Wawa has a sensitive heart. Baby. You, go say something nice to the girl. I, I... Aren't you looking down on her all this time? Why don't you go say something nice to her? <laughs> Keep dreaming. <laughs> I have nothing nice to say to anyone. Uh, you can roam free even to your sealed? Uh, roam free? Is that what you call this? <laughs> this is as far as I can get from her. You think I'd be here playing house with you numbskulls if I could fly away? Well, I guess not. Babes, I'm sorry. I don't know how to tell you nice things right now. Oh. Am I back? Did, did she give me the, the doll so now I can talk? I can talk to her? Um. I'm sorry, Wawa. Are you okay? It's not your fault. It was that bad Heliobus making us fight. <laughs> Someone as nice as you wouldn't say such mean things. Only a possession would make you act like that. Still, what the Heliobus said was true. Oh. I've always been shy and scared. My life's been a nightmare ever since Tail possessed me. That's not your fault, though. When it's like having a school, disability. People were always asking why my tail was on fire. Everywhere I went, people would notice. Oh, oh so it's all my fault. If you yes. just let me devour you at the start, I could have spared you the trouble. <laughs> but it seemed like a viable solution to you. I got into the Ten Lords Commission. Everyone there is weird, so I thought I'd found somewhere I belonged. But the job, the job is too dangerous. Mm -hmm. I have to fight demons and ghosts and bad guys every day. The I, poor thing. I'm just not cut out for it. If I make it back alive, I'm handing in my resignation. Yes, I think you can start a baking business even if your tail is on fire. Actually, it might help you. <laughs> I thought making a heliobope with a heliobus in her tail hunt heliobi was a good idea. <laughs> I'm sorry. Oh, more. I've been so useless. No, you're not. You're doing very well already. Uh, you're the one who left the paper door for me. Thank you. I, I'm glad it helped. You hear that? Stop crying! You're useful! And your paper dolls are useful too. Mm -hmm. Oh, I've had enough of this! As soon you as I swallow him. that coward Cirrus, I'm gonna devour this little crybaby too! Now you won't. What a pity that Mr. Tail is nothing like he used to be. 
If we still had our old power, we could forget about this maze and devour its creator, Furinox. Oh? Your old power? Well, Mr. Tail, seems she knows nothing about your past. Little Missy, do you know why the Heliobire gathered in this abandoned garden instead of seizing human habitations? No? Good answer. Ugh. Because over a thousand years ago, this very garden was the site of an epic battle they between the general of the La Fu and the great Heliobus Ignamar. Oh. Now that the furnace is broken and the Heliobi have escaped, fragments like us, who once constituted Ignamar the Whole, have returned here with a desire to challenge the general again. So you're fragments from the same one? The battle between the General and Ignamar was an earth-shaking contest of devastating proportions. Ignamar underwent countless transformations, causing floods, fires, and thunderous landslides. They were locked in a standoff. An evenly matched fight. Oh? Evenly matched? Really? Evenly matched, really? I didn't know Jinyuana is such a The history. general who fought for the Law Fu against the Heliobus was named Tang Xiao. Oh, he had the same spirit thingy next to him. The Ten Lords Commission records say that Ignamar was soundly defeated by General Tang Xiao. <laughs> of course, the human records would flatter their general. The great Ignamar absorbed the power of countless fellow Heliobi. But ultimately underestimated human deceit. Oh? They were narrowly defeated by the general. Deceit or strategy? We Heliobi could never condense into physical form after that battle. We scattered into fragments and were sealed into the creation furnace. Oh, that's why they were in the furnace? Okay. But Love there's an exception to everything, Mr. Tail. I thought you'd escape to freedom. Who could have guessed you'd be sealed in this tiny Foxian girl? <laughs> Humiliating. Rude. At least he is kind of out there. You sealed my foot! My power was weak when I ran into this fox child. It was bad luck. Nothing more. You say so. When I was littler, I oh. saw a ball of fire that looked like it was about to turn to embers. You're so cute. You have little paw prints in your eyes, too. Oh, she's so baby. I felt sorry for it, so I picked it up and put it on my tail. And then... Mr. Tail tried to eat me! If the judges hadn't arrived, it would have been over! <laughs> to be fair, he tried to go for the weak one first to gain power back, but <laughs> it didn't work. Bah, I did no such thing! You're barely big enough to be an appetizer! Uh, all the pain I've suffered since I met you must be retribution for my stupidity back then. The poor thing. <laughs> Hilarious! It's a pity Mr. Tail didn't devour you. He might have recovered his power and turned the Sienjo upside down. Just like Ignamar did. Hmm. Why did the Iliobai challenge the general? Do you have a grudge against Shanzo? The Shanzo, sorry. Why? Does there have to be a reason? I guess not. The official answer is that the Sienjo is sealing Heliobi in a cage and forcing them to supply energy to the ship. In reality, however, we just want to fight the general and see what the Sienjo is truly made of. Wow. Such a shit reason. <laughs> With so many consequences for you, actually. <sighs> we Heliobi were carefree life forms. But we're tainted with the illness of humanity once we came into contact with it. It's humanity's fault for having such intense emotions and desires. Now we can never, never return to the purity of our past. But I don't feel very comfortable with the way you shifted the blame, though. Okay. I want to be free again. I want to return to the cosmos. Mr. Tail, you don't want to regroup with the fragments? You don't want to be her tail forever? Don't. Why don't you return with me to the great beyond? Well, she could be free, but uh, um, the consequences would not be balanced. <laughs> don't get ahead of yourself, Shiras. Hmm? That 
It's impossible. Mr. Tail was sealed by the judges of the Ten Lords Commission. He can't escape, and neither can you. Ah! The door just opened on its own! Hi. Less screaming, more thinking. Huh? This is an opportunity, is it not? Let's go in and check it out. Ah, uh, I should get this though. Speaking of the Pixtroll Garden, there's a place within its boundaries known as Loku Fox Forest, which was built by Foxian craftsmen for the enjoyment of the garden's visitors. Over the years, they expanded it with elegant buildings, making it with exceptional opulence. General Teng Xiao entered this area, but instead of seeing it, its beauty, he found it in ruins and desolation, filled with eerie and sinister atmospheres. He wondered how a place like this could fall into such despair when Fixtor's garden had only been completed decades prior. He suspected this was the work of Iliobai's illusions. He arrived at a country yard, sorry, and was greeted by a young servant who bowed and offered him a foot box. When he examined it closely, he noticed that the young servant had milky, milky eyes, indicating impairment of eyesight. The food is simple, as a mere token of goodwill. You've come a long way, hungry and tired, for, so my master wishes, you, wishes for you to dine before we discuss matters further. I've passed through at least ten moon gates to get here, but in all my visits to Fixed Stroll Garden, I don't remember encountering so many gates. If, you, if your master wishes to negotiate, they should do so openly and with respect. Where do they find the audacity to play tricks on me? <laughs> the young servant uh, remained unperturbed by Teng Xiao's stern words, as if uh, death to his thunderous reprimand. Reprimand, sorry, I don't know how to read it. <laughs> um, I don't, I know what it means, but I never read it out loud. <laughs> out loud, sorry. With the trick your master likes to deploy with their dark arts, if I were to eat uh, from, from this box, I'd probably find a lump of black mud in my mouth. With a flick of his sleeve, General Teng Xiao tossed the food box onto the ground. Sure enough, it grew spider-like limbs and skittered away. Ew. <laughs> General, with your divine insight and clear deduction, you've already passed the test as a token of acknowledgement that you have just passed that you have just passed the there? What? My master wishes to, uh, to present you with a gift answered the blind serv servant calmly. I read that very wrong, I'm sorry. <laughs> In the side room, there are various chests to choose from. Please select the least expensive one. As for the porcelain vases at the entrance, the blind young servant face twisted into a disturbing smile, no longer resembling that of an innocent youth. My master said, General, after enduring so much on the battlefield, I'm sure you'd show compassion for the wounded and fallen, fallen soldiers. Please break all the cerulean vase. As for the vermilion ones, they must remain intact. It seems that your master is determined to strike this deal no matter what. So this time break all the cerulean. The general let out a long sigh. He looked up and found that the clear moon had disappeared, replaced by thick uh, enveloping clouds. Let's hope they don't come to regret their decision. Tang Xiao strode forward, pushing open the final gate. Okay, break all the cerulean. I feel much cerulean. with you here. Oh. I still feel like I'm gonna faint though. Oh. May the Arbiter protect us. Okay, ah. These are not vases. <laughs> Oh no, yes, okay. I need to get out of here. I should have stopped recording uh, like 10 minutes ago. Did I do it? The door will not open without the proper courtesies. Return from. Okay, what are the proper courtesies? Maybe this? I, I don't think I understood correctly. The courtesies have been performed. Okay, I straight up guest. Oh, honored guest. <laughs> okay. Uh, the doors crack open a silver. Okay, nobody is there. Sorry Look, for skimming. There's a mirror behind the door. 
Didn't oh. I see a similar mirror when I was dragged in? I'm out. Thank God. Hound. What? What? This way. Oh, oh, oh. What's going on? Anya? There's a voice in the mirror. That voice sounds familiar. Let's go. I'm coming through. Make way. Oh, uh, are you in the mirror? I finally found you. Madam Shreyi? Shreyi, right. That is not. That's the voice of the other pretty lady. I confused. I confused the voices of the pretty ladies. Fixtral Garden has been enveloped by an unknown power. You must be careful. Okay. We still it's have my fault, found Miss it? I don't know where she went. The task at hand is to save you from this illusion. Come, pass through the mirror and okay. come to our side. On it. Yay! Oh, are we above Fixtral Garden? In I have a Nencor? Hmm. So many bronze mirrors. Could it be that? Oh, you're here too, fuck. Um, not all the mirrors are real. The illusion is shifting. Uh, you're right, boy. This place is changing. It's trying to stop us from escaping. Huh. But one of these mirrors must contain the exit, right? Let's check them all. Okay. This one is farther. Investigate. The situation in Fixtral Garden is getting worse. Why have you not left? Is something the matter in there? Over here. That sounds like the real Madame Shui. Did I get the right one? What? The real Madame Shui? <laughs> Are there pretenders inside the illusion? There are multiple bronze mirrors. I didn't look at any of the other ones. I went for the farther one because it seemed right. <laughs> I see. Do not be afraid. Huo Hua knows me well. She will be able to discern me from the counterfeits. Okay. But what if I can't tell the difference? You must trust yourself. Come okay, on. maybe. Pass through the mirror. Okay, wow. So. Let's see this one. Investigate. Hurry, Papa. Pass through the mirror and come to me. Wait, I want to ask a few questions to see if you're the real person. Uh, what is the relationship between uh, Sue? Okay, did we manage to become uh, all Tanya of them? is my younger sister, but this alone okay. cannot prove who I am. Ask me something else. They're sisters. I didn't know that. Did they know it? How did you? Where we become our By decree of the Ten Lords, Spirit Fair Hua Hua is skilled and diligent, capable and worthy of officialdom. Why? She is hereby promoted to the position of judge. Is it true? I still remember the decree for her promotion. That's her! Oh. This has to be Madame Shui behind the mirror! It's a so class. we're gonna... We're passing, I trust you. Uh, mirrors again! Oh. What a surprise! Oh. If I have to do it all... Come here, Hua Come to... Uh, I need to Questions. Ask oh no, okay, I'm at the... As a judge responsible for capturing criminals, her cowardice is a dereliction of duty. Oh. I will reprimand her severely once you leave the illusion. Is this the right one? Huh? That doesn't sound like Madame Shui. Okay. Stupid girl! This is... So, I don't so need anything we're else. gonna... Investigate the other mirrors? I'm not None the of best them. judge of things, but these mirrors... Oh! <sighs> not a single one is the real thing! Okay. None of them show Madame Shrei as I know her to be. That puppet judge never I respected when. me. But she also never let her guard down. I've spent a long time working with Madame Shrei. She's always known that I'm scared and timid, but she never told me off. The Ten Lords Commission never cared a wink about your frail constitution. You're the only one who makes a big deal about it. <laughs> and as long as you don't drag me down, I don't really care how much of a coward you are either. What tail? You <laughs> Hey, hey, hey! Get away from me! <laughs> you're so such a softy. Uh, your judgment was pretty accurate. You two actually get along pretty well. What do you know? <laughs> 
<laughs> what are we even talking about? We need to focus. Okay. The illusion wants to keep us in, but it can't possibly keep expanding its borders forever. I think there's got to be a fourth mirror somewhere. I find it. Huh? I think there's a mirror on that oh. floating island. No, it but it's it. a bit far away. Oh. Hi. Oh. I would. Quit stalling and get on with it. Okay, if you're done talking, I'll go. Let's go. Are we out? Ha! I didn't think you'd be able to. <laughs> All these years, and you finally started to grow up a bit. Hurry, Huahua. This should be the last mirror. Nice. Uh, I don't want to go back the way we came, but I need to ask some questions about myself to make sure. What do you think about the Every person? line is different. A judge is not a soldier, and they need more than just courage. It is the decree of the Ten Lords for Hua Hua to be elevated to a judge. There must be some meaning in it. Just what do those old fogies see in this tower? Oh, shush. <gasps> Let's go. This is the right mirror. Hey, test you. <sighs> Are Ooh. we... Back in Fixtral Garden? Can I save now? <laughs> You've returned safely. It seems the Ten Lords Commission is not down on our luck today. Madam Shrey, I'm so happy to see you're all right! Cute. Did you encounter anything strange on your way you're here? so pretty. A lot of strange things. Uh, game's up, Cirrus. Cirrus, get out of my body now. <laughs> no wonder she's a judge. Very <laughs> perceptive. <laughs> Uh, I understand. Oops. This isn't the time to deal with Cirrus. Fixtral Garden has been dragged into a powerful illusion by an even mightier Heliobus. And the spirit bearers who went to suppress it have lost contact with me. Oh my. Huahua, if both Hanya and I are unable to suppress that demon, then you will have to defeat it. A battle. Trust yourself, girly. Do not underestimate yourself. A Heliobus cannot possess a body that is already possessed by another Heliobus. You got such is your absolute advantage as a judge. Heck yeah. I'm also possessed too. Do I also get an advantage? Indeed, even the weakest person has their strength. I know you're trying to comfort me, but that sounded <laughs> a little weird. Yes, I thought too, but it sounded comforting enough. <laughs> you need to start filtering out the stuff you don't want to hear. <laughs> That's what I do. The Heliobi are aggressive beings, but they cannot shake their desire for a flesh and blood body. And yet, during the 38 years you have worked for the Ten Lords, 38? you have been constantly able to suppress the monster within your tail and maintain your personality. Oh. You are already a fitting judge. Oh, so this is, this is your personality, not the warped one. That's nice. That's so On that point, none of the other judges can surpass you. Heck yeah. Suppress the monster. Oh, but I don't think I've ever had to suppress Tail. I guess we're more like friends? Cute. Friends? Ugh. I don't make friends with food. <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Tail, puny fragments like us were deprived of Ignamar's power long ago. If a little girl can subdue us, then perhaps it's time for some humility. <laughs> Shut your trap! Though Fury Nox is powerful, we have a chance of suppressing them if we can break them into multiple fragments. This is fragments. adorable. Okay. You have a sound plan, Your Honor. And since the stage is set, allow me to offer my assistance. Let's find somewhere more open first. Like Swallow Sun Pavilion, over there. I don't trust you. Well, I, I guess I listen. Let's go. Oh my. Can I do it another time? Okay, so... <laughs> I'm out of time today. <laughs> so, for this one, I will stop here. Thank you so much for watching. If you want to, consider subscribing. And I'll see you again next time with part two. Bye-bye!